Hey guys, this is Kelly with the Brain Perspective. Thank you for joining. Today is a, a video that I'm actually giving full credit to the Messed Up Church web channel, video channel, Steve Kozar. Came across this video, it just came out recently, and I was like, wow, this is a really good video. And it really gets into some of the nuts and bolts with people like Bill, Cho Bill Johnson out in Bethel Church out in California. And it really just it lays out a lot of good information about false prophecy, false teaching, and warnings to the church. So if you are a person who is a supporter of someone like Bill Johnson, this is something that you really need to see. And if you know others, it would be good to share with. And definitely check out uh, the Messed Up Church channel. I subscribe to it. Check it out for yourself. See what you think about it. And um, again, I'm going to be giving this video here. He gave me the support uh, and ability to do it. So I'm going to basically be playing with that and check it out. Tell me what you guys think, and I think this is a good video for people to be informed on why people like Bill Johnson and the new Apostolic Reformation counterfeit false movement. People need to be aware of these things because these things are bad, they're false, they're false prophets, they're false apostles, they're false teachers, and sadly, many people in the body of Christ are being led astray, and this is a really bad reflection upon the body of Christ, amen? And also, please... Hey, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, Brain Perspective, please do. Visit our website, rootedinchrist.org. Also, check us out on iTunes. Lord bless you. Check out this video. The party will not end. Uh, one other thing I'm going to read to you. <clears throat> I, I don't always, um, for whatever reason, I don't always read the words that we get, the prophetic words. Uh, some of them are given publicly. Probably we should do a little better job maybe of making the prophetic words to the house available to you. We'll, we'll try to work on, maybe we can have a private website where we publish all this for Bethel members. <clears throat> um, but this one was given to me this week by Steve Witt. Steve Witt has been a very accurate and faithful prophetic voice. Very accurate and faithful prophetic voice to us. A great encouragement to me. Uh, his daughter was a part of our school of ministry for a couple years. And uh, he was just with us, I think, last Sunday, Sunday before. Anyway, he wrote this word. And, and uh, there's one phrase in here that, that helped me to realize I really need to read this to you. Even though the whole thing is good for all of us. Um, <clears throat> Uh, there was just something that kind of pushed me over the edge. I'll explain it afterwards. <coughs> Excuse me. 2004, Sundial Bridge was a turning point for Reading and for Bethel. It was a breach in the heavens, a Jacob's ladder. It's as if the enemy could not hold his finger in the dike any longer. The bridge is a symbol of the sons of Issachar. They understood and knew what to do. This is the Reading anointing, a chief navigator in perilous times. Remember that phrase for your sake. Chief navigator in perilous times. Revelation is the natural byproduct. Bridge is a sign. Reading is about to advance quickly as a city, doubling in size. Doubling in size. Very accurate. A boom town, that which was the butt of California jokes. Hey, <laughs> will become a jewel. There's fire. In some of those tornadoes, they were classifying those as equal to an F3, possibly an F4 tornado that you would see back east. Uh, the only difference is, is they estimated the temperature in these tornadoes to be 2,700 degrees. Will become a jewel. There's fire. I sense that Governor Schwarzenegger will be a key. I saw him coming to Reading. 
a veil being removed off his face. And fail the people of California. He will see Redding as it is seen by heaven. He will blow a trumpet, declare to all of California that Redding is open for business. This will be a turning point and a draw for business in Redding, be a magnetism, as well as attracting national headquarters to the area. Properties will skyrocket. This is the time to buy, to buy and build in Reading. There's fire! That takes an incredible amount of wind, as well as um, high tension wire uh, utility poles knocked down as well from the wind. And the best metric they've come up with for this kind of event, an EF3 tornado on the Fujita scale. These new companies in the area will love the young, vibrant workforce created from the Bethel culture. California looks right now from 250 miles above Earth. Astronaut Alexander Gerst snapped these photos as he flew overhead aboard the International Space Station. And we're learning more about the wicked storm that roared across Shasta County and into Redding last week. A freak of nature, the fire NATO. Bethel will inadvertently become an employment and deployment agency. Ultimately, churches will seek your students, but so will companies. I also said that commuter flights from Sacramento to Reading would soon be offered. I believe within two years, but I'm not clear on that. It will be a sign that a new level is emerging. Watch for the name of the airline. I sense it will have a prophetic meaning. Finally, I wrote a prayer on the morning of Sunday last while in Reading. I submit it as it is a prayer. I bless you with Reading, I uh, bless you Reading with revelation from heaven. The fire NATO. By that you may see a salve for salvation. Let the light of God shine upon you and the river of sacrament flow through you. May you understand the times and know what to do. You are a sundial in the spirit. Spirits rise and spirits fall. Reveal your secrets. Tell us all. His light will cause you to heal the past, comprehend the present, and interpret the future. The fire NATO. He has given you eyes to see and will establish you as a think tank. Shake a baba. A think tank. You are a place that brings understanding, <clears throat> and many will enter in and find rest. Like a fire in me. Abraham's, Isaac's, and Jacob's will dwell in harmony in this place. Multiple generations. There will be a place for all to dwell, and your second generation will inhabit the land and conquer its giants and cities. Very accurate. I have hidden you for a reason, but not for long. National business headquarters will be drawn here. Writing will shine like a city of hope. Do not fear. Open the door. As you open this earthly door, my heavenly door will exhaust you with my blessing. Anybody ready to be exhausted? Oh, I'm ready to be exhausted. Exhaust me with your blessings. That's right. Exhaust me with your blessings. That's right. The firestorm that burned into Reading last week was not something we see very often, and even the experts are at a loss for words. Heat is rapidly rising off the ground, and that's what happened with this fire world. You saw a lot of erratic winds and the intense heating that had to escape and go upward. Exhaust me with your blessings. Redding understood the times and knew what to do. There's five statements. This is a time for hospitality. This is a time to buy. Once again, please, please evacuate everyone and, and stay safe. Have a good night. This is a time to learn deeper in the spirit. Increase, 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 increase. This is a time to learn deeper in the spirit. This is a time for deep relationships. The party will not end. The party will not end. Oh, that's a good word.
once again, please, please evacuate everyone and, and stay safe. Have a good night.